Hi everyone, uh, this is the uh, end of week five, December 7th. Uh, end of week five was yesterday. I'm kind of uh, crunched for time here. Today is uh, chemo day, so I, uh, I missed a day of, of uh, uh, the gym this week because of fatigue. Uh, you know, fatigue is setting in more uh, this week than last week, so uh, I made it up on my, uh, on my chemo day. Um, so I'm just leaving the gym now in the morning. I'm gonna go back, get cleaned up, and uh, go do chemo. Um, but uh, as far as week five goes, um, oh, and I'm doing it in the truck because uh, I'm, I'm short on time. Uh, as far as week five goes, you know, my uh, my throat is drier and sore than it was last week. Um, it is. Uh, it feels smaller than it did last week. Um, sorry, the phone keeps moving. Um, it's, uh, you can hear it in my voice. My voice is a little scratchier. So, it, you know, it, it's incrementally getting worse um, as far as that goes. Uh, as far as the uh, cetuximab uh, versus the cisplatin, no question. The cetuximab, hands down, is better. Um, as, far, as far as side effects goes, uh, it's, I've really received none. Other than, uh, you know, my face, uh, you know, they said there could be a rash. I, I didn't really get the rash yet, but uh, you know, my face is a lot redder uh, than it even usually is um, from here down. And, you know, that's that's because of the uh, uh, radiation too. But I think the cisplatin kind of uh, amplifies that a little bit. Um, and it's my face is real, real dry. So, you know, I got to treat it with you know, this stuff I use. But anyways. Um, just to try to keep it moist, keep the burns down. Um, it's essentially a sunburn. You know, it'll uh, supposedly go away uh, after treatment's over in two weeks. I got two weeks of treatment left. Um, and that's that's really about it for week five. N nothing, uh, nothing big. Nothing. You know, no no great news to let you know about. Um, oh, I there's one my feeding tube continues to be a pain in the ass uh, I hate it uh, but uh, you know it's I don't use it anymore really it uh, wish they'd take it out now but I doubt they'll do that now um, but anyways uh, they called it a granulation underneath there's a rubber flange I guess up against my skin to keep it in and uh, there's like a little nodule that grew along the hole um, for lack of a better term it kind of looked like a hemorrhoid um, it was gross so I went in yesterday and they put silver nitrate on it and uh, that's supposed to reduce it make it smaller and uh, now it, it turned gray and uh, it's dying it's just just a pain in the ass the, this tube is a pain in the ass I don't think I could recommend this for anyone really uh, at this point in the game but, uh, you know, the next two weeks will be telling. We'll, we'll know. Um, everything I've read, uh, everybody I've talked to said, you know, the last two weeks are, are definitely the worst. Um, so, you know, it could get could get worse from here. Or, you know, I, I don't know. I don't know. But uh, we'll find out together. And I will uh, I'll keep everybody updated. Uh, next Wednesday, Thursday, I'll throw up another video and, and let you know how I'm doing. All right. We'll see you then.